Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Y'all ready? My name is Shireen Moneymill from the Upside Down Smiley Show, and we are going to wrap up the Kananaya series. If you haven't checked it out, there are four episodes on the Kananaya series for the Upside Down Smiley Show at patreon.com slash upside down smiley. If you're a Malayali, I'm sure you are very familiar with what the Kanani community is, but if not, the Kanani community is a ethnic community from Kerala, India, which is where my family is from, that practices endogamy, which is basically marrying within the community to maintain it. I am so thankful for the four people that were involved in this series, four people that share their experiences, their journeys, their stories. What I think is super powerful is everyone can relate to someone's story. Even if you're not Kananaya, even if you're not Malayali or Indian, there is a connection that you can kind of understand, you know, people's experiences in tradition or just like how you were raised or how you grew up. I wanted to create a space where people could share their truth. We could have conversations that may be uncomfortable for some people and have conversations with people that you may not always agree with. And that's what the Upside Down Smiley Show is about, having those kinds of conversations. As I saw people joining the Patreon, I was reminded of how important it is for our generation to have these kinds of conversations because I didn't have examples of my parents or my elders having these more challenging conversations. I am so thankful for the Kanani community. I'm so thankful for all of your support. I have a beautiful marriage. I have family. I have friends all over the country because of this community. I personally was not raised very closely within the community. I actually had to ask my parents to take me to events. And because of that is probably the reason why I am one of four siblings that ended up with a Kanani partner. And I can't really speak to my siblings experience, but I can say that it is unfortunate that my siblings and their families can no longer be a part of the Kananaya community. And this series was about the pressures of marrying Kananaya. And I think we can all admit that there are people that have experienced pressure in choosing a partner within the Kananaya community. And we all know and we have all seen people being treated poorly because of that decision. No matter what side of endogamy or sharing traditions you are on, I would love to see us come together to share this message of treating people in our community, people beyond our community with love and respect. And that was the point of this series, to start the conversation. And I hope you all can continue this conversation publicly or even privately with your family, with your friends, with your networks. And I just wanna say thank you so much for all of your support. I ask you to continue to have these kinds of conversations, continue to dig deep, continue to show up honestly. I'm passionate about pushing through those uncomfortable feelings to say your truth and to continue to talk to people that you may not see eye to eye so that we can grow. And so I appreciate you all. Thank you so much for being a part of this. Thank you so much for um, supporting this series and I appreciate you. Goodbye.